Together, we're a group of the most important people in their lives. And they've brought us here to recognize that we've all played some special part in the love that they share. These words spoken today between Taylor and Michael are indeed important and sacred. We are not here to witness the lasting bond that already exists between them. Taylor and Michael have already joined their hearts together and chosen to walk together on life's journey. And we have come here to bear witness to a symbolic union and a public affirmation of the love that they share. Marriage gives permanence and structure to a couple's love. It's a way to tell one another that we're in this together. Marriage is telling the person you love that you're not going anywhere, and that's a powerful commitment. A good marriage must be built on the foundation of this commitment. In marriage, the little things are the big things. It is never being too old to hold hands. It is remembering to say, I love you. It is standing together and facing the world. It is speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in thoughtful ways. It is having the capacity to forgive and forget. It is giving each other an atmosphere in which each can grow. It is a common search for the good and the beautiful. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. Mike, you are my best friend. You are, <laughs> sorry. You are my soulmate for this life and the next. I know for certain that you were put on this earth to be my guardian angel. I'm here today to make a promise to you in front of all of our most cherished loved ones. I promise to love you, respect you, support you, and to give you strength as you conquer all of your highest hopes and dreams. Most importantly, I promise I will continue to never fully place a cap on any of the spices, peanut butter, or pasta. <laughs> You've made me the happiest man in the world today. I promise to love you, cherish you, care for you, protect you. I will comfort you in times of sorrow and distress. You are my everything. And I can't wait to start this new, this new and exciting adventure with the person I love most in this world. It's not as long as hers, but... <laughs> by the power vested in me by Universal Life Ministries, <laughs> I now pronounce you husband and wife. Woo! And I kiss the bride. Look at the camera! Look at the camera! made it through this and I'm really proud I'm, I'm so happy that Taylor's found 
a great family to, to join, and we're happy to join your family. We just want to say that, you know, the challenges that, that, that we faced here are, you know, we, we face throughout all our lives, and that we want to make sure that we're always here for each other. And that's, this is the foundation of everything, family, right? And this is what we're here for, and to never have to face things alone. We're always here for each other. Growing up, Mike and I were only a year and a half apart, so we were incredibly close. We even shared bunk beds until we were about eight years old. Can we talk about how beautiful this ride is? Hello, Cosmo? Is that you? Tay, I truly love you like a sister, and I can't believe you actually are my sister now, and I cannot wait for the rest of our lives. One, one last thing, I, I do want to thank Jen and, and Taylor herself for planning pretty much this whole wedding. I, I participated as much as I could, but uh, you guys were fantastic. So this is, everything turned out awesome. Could you see